Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be all about my review and my thoughts on this product. Um, it is the Pink Himalayan Salt Inhaler that I did my previous video on. I talk about the reasons I wanted to search for a more holistic and natural approach to treating and curing my asthma. I purchased this little guy off of Amazon. It was less than $10 because I didn't want to invest too much money into something I've never tried before. I use this morning and night for 30 days and so I believe that is like a long enough experiment to trial a product to see if it works well. So with my results, um, they were pretty astonishing um, to say the least. I have not had to once use my nebulizer breathing machine at all this whole entire month. Um, prior to using this, I used to use my breathing machine a few times a week um, at nighttime. Usually I use my breathing machine like right before I go to bed because throughout the day I would accumulate maybe like dust in my lungs or things that I'm allergic to would kind of inflame the muscles in my lungs and so right before bed I really couldn't fall asleep if I was wheezing so I would always use my breathing machine right before bed for like a few seconds I didn't need to take a whole one um, and typically I would use my inhaler a few times a week if I was ever triggered by let's say animals or dust or exercise or something like that so throughout this whole month, I have not once used my breathing machine and my inhaler usage cut down, I'd say by 50%. Um, this definitely is not a product I would recommend in an emergency situation. Um, if I was having an asthma attack, I probably wouldn't reach for this because this is more of a long-term type of product. Um, if I was in an emergency having an asthma attack, I would definitely reach for the medication that is meant to immediately relax my lungs so that way I can get air. Um, but yeah, so this month, the times when I found myself wheezing, those times where I would typically reach for my inhaler, I reached for this instead to see if this would calm me down and um, work better than my inhaler. And for a few times it did. Um, when I was wheezing, I would reach for this and inhale it for a few minutes and for some of the times my wheezing went away completely and for other times when it was a bit more excessive, I still needed my normal inhaler. I'm definitely going to continue using this from here on out. Um, I said this in my last video and I think it's pretty obvious. but. Um, just a reminder, I'm not a medical professional and I'm not a doctor, so I'm not telling you to like throw your asthma medicine away and start using this, like a more natural approach. This is just what I did because I was sick of using medicine and depending on my inhaler for every time I was wheezing. They also have pink Himalayan like salt inhalers that look kind of like a chapstick. I'm going to look into doing that as well so I could just throw it in my bag like my purse because this uh, is quite big to put in my purse. I don't think I would want to do that. Apart from this, I actually started using an air purifier for my bedroom a few days ago and I'll show you quickly what that looks like. And that has helped my asthma incredibly since I've combined using this with the air purifier for the past like four days. I would highly recommend this product if you're looking for a more natural approach to um, help treating your asthma and yeah, thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye!